I am packing a month worth of clothing and one carry-on in one hour. Oh, no way. Are seven pairs of shoes essential? Yes. If I fold it vertically, I can fit so much in here. My situation is I just got back from San Francisco. I actually fit seven pairs of heels in this side. So all I would need to do is stuff clothing here. These are things I brought back. Um, I got these for the plane to, oops, to use with my friends. I'm going with my high school best friend, my really good friend from New York, and then my best friend from San Francisco. So this will be really exciting. I'll just make this an informative video on how to pack and how to maximize your space in your suitcase. You wanna know the task that I have? What? Yes, come say hi. Jen and Elliot are here. Can I have a piece of gum? I am packing a month worth of clothing and one carry-on in one hour. I'm gonna be in Europe for a whole month. Wow. And I'm gonna pack it all in an hour. I haven't even started oh my yet. Goodness. I haven't started yet. Come back in an hour. A time lapse. Three, two, one. Transition. Do you guys believe in me? Yeah. I might need some help. I need to get the suit. Up there. You need a tall guy. I do uh, need a tall guy. Oh. Any tall guys? I'm single. <laughs> yeah, that big one. Ready? I'll lift you. Wow, no way. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Ready? Wow, that was great. Yeah. Okay. Stay tuned. <laughs> I'm going to Lisbon in about five hours. It's 2 p.m. I'm going to Lisbon in five hours and we're going from Lisbon to Mallorca to Barcelona to Paris. And I'm gonna bring you guys all along. I'm so bleep beep 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 excited. And I'm actually meeting my friend Zara who I met during Copenhagen Fashion Week in Lisbon because she's from there. And when people say come visit me, I always take them up on the opportunity because why, why else not? I would, I like just send that shit. So these are a bunch of vintage pieces I picked up in San Francisco that I have to pack. And I'm gonna show you guys how I roll it into my suitcase. Oh gosh, how do I put this on? I have such exciting pieces I wanna show you. You guys get a sneak peek of what I'll be wearing in Europe. I brought back a bunch of sunscreen and dry shampoo to bring to the Europe trip. I feel like this is all about figuring out what is essential and what isn't. Are seven pairs of shoes essential? Yes, so we're gonna have to pack that in. Before I left for New York, I packed this box filled with swimsuits because I knew I wanted to bring, so I just had something prepped ahead of time. So what I'm gonna do with these chiffon pieces, I also have to bring a steamer because I'm not letting these things wrinkle. You know, it's gonna look drabby. The nice thing is that you can roll it up. So I just like fold it in half and I roll it. And like, I always make sure I get into each crevice of the suitcase. So we're gonna start with the bottoms first because tops are just so easy to squish. So I have that skirt. I have these parachute pants. I actually just got this in the mail today. Um, these are from Motel Rocks. Thank you Motel Rocks for the pants. I am clearly into baggy pants. These are from Urban. If you didn't watch my lookbook, I have it linked in the description. But yeah, I'm just so excited. It's just so much fun to wear cute outfits and go out dressed up with your girls. But look at this little Jacquemus skirt that I got. This one I bought from Farfetch. And then I got this to wear with the skirt. The nice thing about buying these kinds of pieces is that it's very versatile. So even if I want to wear this with the skirt, I can also wear with black trousers, I can wear it with a white button up and jean shorts, I can wear it with a midi skirt, a maxi skirt, literally everything, and maybe even some simple heels. There's like this really cute strappy detail. Look at how cute this mini skirt is. I think I'm gonna bring this as well. I think mini for skirts you can never go wrong because like it's such a light layer to bring. So like if I fold it vertically, I can fit so much in here. I'm also packing little essentials like some hydration multipliers because it's easy to forget to drink water on vacation. I'm just being actually prepared because I'm the mother of the group and I'm supplying all the clothes and the heels. Most of the time when people can't fit things in their suitcase, it's because they allow too much air. So if you just fold it vertically and squeeze, 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 
then everything's good. Next thing, neutral swimsuit tops. Neutral swimsuit tops you can throw under any blouse. You can literally wear it as a top. I mean, this is kind of scandalous to be wearing out, but so, so cute. The nice thing is that you can buy like lace cover-ups and things on your vacation and just wear these under. Just a nude undergarment that adds a little something because it's a swimsuit, so it'll give you that coverage. Oh my gosh, look how pretty this is. Slip dresses, that's my next essential. Slip dresses you can wear to bed. Imagine you're in your hotel room, there's a sheer curtain and you're drinking a cup of coffee. Or imagine there's a balcony outside, or imagine you're going on a night out and you wear knee high boots. It's so versatile. Oh my gosh, look, okay, basically what I did was I folded it in half, in half again, and half, like Marie Kondo vibes, and you stick it on the side. These skirts, I can layer, layer on the top, very flat. But these chiffon ones, I can always, sometimes I'll take the tag and I'll use that as my base. So for example, I'm using this tag and wrapping around it because then I can wrap it extra tight. And then from there, I'll fold it straight down. Literally, I squeeze this skirt into this little pouch and I'm fitting it in this corner. Do you see this? Look at that. I would say my last essential though, um, nice pair of trousers, nice pair of dress pants because you never know if you're going to go to something that requires a more modest dress code. It's always good to play it safe. You know, sometimes if you're visiting a temple, you have to be respectful of religion. It's good to be prepared and have modest clothing. This is pretty successful. <laughs> this dress, a little black dress. The reality of the situation is that I managed to fit everything in this tiny suitcase. The best part is that I get to squeeze all of it in and sit on it and zip it up. Extra things that I packed just in case to be extra prepared, some European adapters for the outlets and this SD card adapter. This one is also one that goes direct directly to my phone for my digital camera. Here we go. I will probably need band-aids for my blisters. But we can buy that in Lisbon because they have band-aids worldwide. <laughs> okay, we're gonna stuff all these socks into this zipper pouch right here. Okay, ready? One for each day of the week. And then I'm just gonna rewear it for a month. No, I'm just kidding. I'll wash it. I will be washing. I also think I'll just be wearing heels the whole time, so is this even that necessary? No. Do I just like to show off that I can pack hella fucking shit in the suitcase? Hell yeah, bro, because I'm a pro. I, I think I fit a whole store in here. What I also like to do in packing, my mom taught me this, is to put my underwear in a laundry bag. This just helps me separate my clean from dirty underwear. It's Hello Kitty one. Actually, it's not even mine. My friend Emily gave it to me. Thanks, Emily. <laughs> Never put anything expensive or lacy or mesh on the side because the zipper will get caught. Here. There's no zipper on this though. I can strap this even tighter. Ta-da! I fit it in. I hope this video was very helpful to packing some wardrobe essentials. My last few tips are just that I always put my jewelry in my carry-on because then I always have an eye on it. This is a jewelry holder that my best friend from school's mom got for me as a graduation gift, so I just got this and it fits everything super nicely. It has my name on it and it's in my favorite color. Thank you, Miss Lee Wilson. Last thing is that I also have a pouch for my passport and everything so that when I'm going through security, I always just have things. I have a hongbao in here for my cash. Shout out, to my, shout out to my Chinese friends. And I have some tampons. I just put in this pouch. So it's like good for cash and receipts. Like when you go shopping, you can put all your duty free things and just have all your airport essentials ready. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in Lisbon!
did not sponsor this video, but Ramoa, if you see this, I love you in your suitcases. You're amazing.